been um, having worship with Pastor Jay, um, experiencing the Holy Spirit, talking in tongues, um, people getting healed. We were praying, worshiping, and um, people just got laid down in fire in the Holy Spirit. Pastor Jay laid hands on me and um, he told me, God told me to keep on doing what I'm doing, which is playing drums and um, keep on worshiping him for his glory. Uh, a lot of like the Holy Spirit moving, I've always like experienced a lot of like the Holy Ghost, but um, I don't know, it's just been like more powerful here for some reason. It was crazy last night to see the Holy Spirit move through everyone. It was yeah. really cool. I didn't think I'd see anything like it, but it was awesome. I always thought that like only certain people um, had the gift of like like speaking with tongues, and like this weekend showed me that everyone could do it. It's really cool. I got a lot of prayer over my knee, and it's weird. Like it feels, it feels completely fine. It was a pretty bad injury too, and so like getting as much prayer as I did, it feels a hundred times better. I didn't really like want to even come here at first. But I like kind of made like a last second choice and you know like just to kind of like find out what my calling was and like how like I was kind of like meant to be a leader which is kind of cool to know. One of the biggest things that God showed me is when everyone was worshiping and just laughing and speaking in tongues. Um, I just saw everyone kind of turn into like a different race or a different culture and just got like glimpses of around the world and just God uh, telling me I'm going to go to the nations, something that I've had in my heart for a long time, but I just needed that extra clarity about doing that. And so seeing that vision was really cool. I'm just motivated to keep it going. I don't want this to just be a camp high. I want this to be a lifestyle for me. And I want my future to be seeing this everywhere I go and not just at camps and without snow. <laughs>